Hey everyone, Leo here with Digital Track. I wanted to jump on and make a quick video to share some information about the marketing king of fast food, right? McDonald's. How can you, as a business owner, small business owner, even if you're not a restaurant, take some some of the ideas, right, on this that on this marketing strategy that McDonald's is using that you can implement in your own business to increase your sales. Um, for those of you that don't know me, my name is Leo. I'm here waiting outside in downtown Solano County to meet somebody. I have a company called Digital Track, helping small business owners here in the Solano County area um, in increase the sales and customers by basically helping them getting exposure, online exposure of their business. Right, either be through paid advertising, make sure that they have some kind of online press presence, uh, social media marketing, etc. So let's go ahead and continue with the story. And my camera, for some reason, is freezing, but at least hopefully you can hear my voice. Let me know if you can hear me. I know this is not a live video, but let me know for those of you that see me. Let me know where you watching this video from. Uh, let me get to know about about you. Right, where you're watching this video from, where. Um, what type of business you do, etc. And so, the marketing concept that businesses should learn, small businesses, right? The I saw a promotion f from McDonald's recently about getting the premium sandwiches for a dollar. Get one premium sandwich for a dollar. We're talking about, you know, sandwiches that cost four, five, six dollars in retail. And why are they doing that? How can they do that, right? Well. Number one, obviously, they have a big marketing footprint. They have a lot of money to invest in marketing. But why would they invest into, you know, losing money up front by giving these sandwiches for $1, uh, where usually they can make four, five, six, right? But the strategy is you got to think the long term game for what I was looking at, okay? What the, 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 incentive is the dollar sandwich but in order for you to get that you'd have to download the app in order for you to get all their special coupons including this one you have to download the app and so you were probably asking yourself but Leo I don't have the money to uh, build an app and how is that gonna help them well it helps them to create another channel for McDonald's to continue to stay in contact with people that like their food okay Whatever you think about McDonald's, either if they're the best burgers or not, obviously they're not. For I'm sure a lot of will have a lot of us they will have that opinion, right? They don't have the best best burgers at all, but they do are they are one of the top chain fast food chain restaurants, right? Um, and the reason why is because they know marketing, but they write it, they look into invest into things like this to play the long game, right? They will get they will get you to download the app. You have the app. And they continue to incentivize you to stay using the app because here's where you're gonna get special coupons or promotion that you will not get somewhere else. And if you like, uh, are, are, you know, if you are a family man that loves discounted food, or if you are just a, you know, uh, young person, a teenager that just lo love this type of food because they're convenient, they're 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 food, they're, they're cheap, etc. You'll do things like this to stay in contact, right? You you download the app and you stay on the app. And so what this happened is McDonald's finds another channel to stay in contact with you. They, they perhaps already have advertising, they have social media communications, they have email communications, and they're also investing in the this uh, real estate, is it real estate space, right? It's, it's real estate, let's face it, having be for them to be able to communicate with you directly on their on your phone is real estate for them there's no greater real estate right now that uh, uh, companies can do right now that stay in front of you on, on, on the devices because let's face it I go with it everywhere right it's, it, it helps me to do so so many more things so many things that it's it's a tool it's a tool that I use on, my, on a daily basis and they know that and what a best way to um, again have a presence or continue to stay in close contact with you that through an app 
right uh, through an app they can uh, send you notifications and let you know when uh, when they have something new or when they have a new special offer and promotion and I know you as a business owner probably have the money to invest in an app but think about other ways that you can use um, <clears throat> that won't cost you know that you can adjust it to your budget but yet that would allow you to stay in con in contact with them because come on it's a service that you'll do to stay communi to communicate to you, your customers to your loyal customers what you have going on how many times we we hear something like um, oh I missed the offer that you had too bad it looks so good or man I wish I would have won right um, or wish I, I wish I would have been there etc right because that's that's my way of thinking that it's a disservice to be not be able to communicate all this to our loyal customers right special promotions but again you don't have to invest a lot of money you can do simple things like MailChimp is a email provider that up to 2,000 contacts you can send bulk emails to whoever decides to stay on your list for free right obviously it requires you time to get to learn the application and it, it's a very simple to use but um, I, I'm a technical person right my uh, what might be simple for me may not be for you however it's very simple to use um, and then with the push of the button you can send communication to hundreds of people that they or even thousands right depending on how many you have your list and so that's the power on staying in contact right um, email is obviously not as effective but still very uh, relevant way to stay communicated um, all other things you can do is uh, text message marketing uh, uh, Facebook messenger marketing Facebook messenger marketing right now is very is very uh, popular right very demanding uh, it, it's on demand people a lot of businesses are, requ are requesting for this to uh, to be part of their marketing communication channel because let's face it think about your own situation when whenever you receive a message on Facebook um, now, obviously, you you could be one of those persons that to, co completely remove social media from their phone just because you you don't want anything to do with it, right? You 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 perhaps have other mentality, but most of us uh, will be checking their uh, Facebook Messenger all the time. As soon as we get a message, we hear the, the the sound, right? That we get a new message, we'll be there checking it. Uh, especially as a, as a business owner if, if you have a new uh, message from a customer and so um, with this with McDonald's it's it's a long-term game right they, they they will stay in contact with you through this app they will push in notifications they can use this app to push notification because a lot of people don't turn them off and us as small business owners who can implement something similar to stay in contact with our with our customers right what better way to stay than stay in contact with our loyal customers people that already know us people that already bought from us instead of constantly pushing information to people that perhaps don't even know us yet right so we gotta invest a lot more into staying in contact with people that already like to buy from us compared to people that we still gotta earn their trust right um, to, and basically just <clears throat> go for those that uh, that already know us so that's the the, the information I want to go over today I have a special bonus if you are a small business owner have a contest going on that to July 31st one lucky winner will be um, getting a special services from me so if you are looking for ways to increase the exposure of your business online right you have a local store but you just don't have the technical knowledge to make sure your business is populated online um, uh, that's one of the things I'm giving away in a contest the other thing is I will be setting up a website for you if you don't have one and the other third thing is I will be setting up the social media profiles for you up to three um, if, if you don't have one already if you already have a website if you already have a social media profile you still want a new one or somebody to come and help you set it up um, properly then it's still it's gonna be part of, uh, of the service I'm gonna provide so well, all you have to do to participate is just put your name of the business below uh, please like and share and tag this uh, post post a video and again post it post the name of your business below and uh, good luck if you're gonna be participating uh, if you 
have any questions, let me know. Uh, you can visit digitaltrack.co or www.digitaltrack.co or you can just um, uh, text or call 707-410-0307. Okay, have a good one.